Hi. Welcome to Love and Forever Evolving, where we are always and forever evolving. Hello, Leos. Welcome back, my loves. Welcome to your love reading. I hope all is well, Leos. Look into taking care of yourselves, eating plenty of fruit and vegetables, and taking care of that beautiful, sexy ass temple of yours, Leos. As it take care of you, my loves. Welcome back. Come on in. Have a seat. We're going to see what messages, source, your guardian angels, and your ancestors have for you when it comes to your love life. All right. Shout out to the evolving spirit. Shout out to the soul tribe. Gang, gang. Thank you all so much for your continuous love and support. I appreciate you. I thank you so much, Leos. All right. First, today, we're going to start with your person and your energy. We're going to dive straight into it. With no tarot, um, oracle cards, or any of that, we're going to dive straight into the tarot, all right, to see what's going on with the connection with you and your person. Then we'll see how your person feels, and of course, we'll wrap it up with some word advice from your guardian angels and your ancestors, Leos, all right? Source angels, ancestors, please protect my space and aura as I chime the messages here today for Leo placements. What do we have for Leo placements? Sun, moon, rising, Venus, north, and south node. Show me Leo's person's energy here, guardian angels, ancestors. Show me the person that Leo is engaging here with or thinking about here. Show me their energy, please. All right, the top portion here is going to be your person's energy here, Leo's. And it's going to be your energy here at the bottom and how you feel towards this connection here. And the mutual energy between you two. The bottom of the deck here we have is the Eight of Wands here, okay? Quick communication is coming in here, okay? Someone else may be traveling to you as well here, Leos, okay? This could be a fire sign like yourself. This could be a Sagittarius and Aries here or a Leo like yourself here, all right? There is definitely someone coming in here. It's going to be some quick, fast communication here as well. Something is going to pick up for you as well here. Okay. Wow. And that's what's going on at the bottom of the deck. So that's what you don't expect here coming in the future, loves. All right. So let's see here. Let me move the cards down so you can see here in regards to the energies that we're working with here today. Let's see how your person feels towards you, Leos. Wow. Wow. We have the death card here, Scorpio energy here, okay? This situation here has changed, I feel like, dramatic, dramatically here, okay? This particular person, again, this could be your person. This could be you, Leos, okay? Because this is your person's energy and how they feel towards you or this connection here, okay? They feel that the relationship or the connection here has changed, okay? It has transformed into something different, something new here, okay? We have the Knight of Wands here. Here's your energy, Leos, okay? Leo, Sagittarius, and Aries here, okay? Hmm. What else we have here? The full card. Aries energy here, Leo. Some of you are this person may be in Aries here. But I'm getting whatever pattern here that your person or this person that you engaged here with in the past here, okay? Whatever they used to do. They no longer do that, okay? This could have been someone that was in and out of your life here, okay? It could have been a fire sign. Again, here's someone that, you know, didn't stay for long, wasn't as grounded as you would like for them to have been. So that way, this could be in a more grounded, stable relationship. But I feel like now that has changed, okay? With the death card coming out, something has been put to an end. Some type of pattern or way of doing things have been put to the end. And this is why we have the fool card here stepping out and taking that leap of faith. So I feel like now your person here, they could have had a pattern of doing something that you did not like or didn't agree with. Okay. And now this person has put that particular pattern or cycle to an end here. And now they're willing to take a leap of faith towards you, Leos, towards this connection here. Some of you know, this person may be literally traveling to you. Okay. They could be at a distance from you here and is traveling to you now. All right, let's see how you feel towards this person here. Wow, we have the King of Cups here. There's definitely love here between you two, okay? 
This could be, again, a Scorpio. Again, this is Scorpio energy here. They could have water placements in their chart as a Cancer and a Pisces here. All right. But there's definitely love here between you two. Hmm. Okay. That makes sense. We have the Ten of Swords here. Okay. This is air energy here, Leos. All right. This could be Aquarius here, a Gemini or a Libra here. Okay. This is someone here who, you know broke your heart who portrayed you in the past here several of times okay this is not i feel like the first time that this person has come across this type of situation or pattern of doing things here okay this is someone who portrayed you and hurt you however this is someone here who uh you loved okay you had feelings here for okay and this person portrays you several times here like i said this person always came in yeah you guys had a good old time with each other of course yes always had a good time with each other here no matter what but this person here always find ways here to either fuck things up or don't take in consideration your feelings and how you feel about this person and they've always find ways to do things to, you know, make decision, decisions and outcomes worse, okay? And this is a situation here where that process, again, has changed for this person here. We have the Two of Pentacles here. Yeah, we have you here showing up in the Two of Pentacles, either indecisive in regards to making a decision towards this person because like I said, some of you on know, this person may have already came in towards you to ask for your forgiveness, to ask for another chance here. Because they're definitely taking a leap of faith. <clears throat> and I get some of you all being indecisive here. Okay, you may have more than one thing going on here or trying to juggle more than one thing on your plate here. But it's like this person now wants to come back in and take a leap of faith, take a risk to try to see if they can start this over with you because we have the yellow here in the background start over start fresh here let's see what the mutual energy between you two we have the four of pentacles here leos okay but i get that you both are holding back towards each other you're not too much expressing yourselves or communicating with this person here because of how this person already treated you in the past here you're not trying to give this person no time no money no effort no opportunity you're really close off because of this person and how they treated you here in the past right this is the same energy i will be showing up in as well because of this person hurting you in the past here several times and it's like this person as well because this is mutual energy this person is holding back as well because they know how they treated you they know what your response is going to be here wow leo's definitely if the reading has resonated so far don't forget to hit that big fat thumbs up show spirit some love again if you're new here welcome welcome subscribe my love spirit part of family this is definitely what we love and we evolve each and every day here on this platform all right i definitely am available for personal readings if you would love to book a personal reading with me all that information is down below in the description box my loves Let's see how this person feels. Let's see what they want to say right now. Since there is not as much communication here. Let's see what this person wants to say right now to you. Because they definitely want to come towards you. Rather, if it takes them traveling to you, uh, communicating to you. They're going to try to come towards you here if they haven't already. They want to try to take this leap of faith and try and start over again. Yeah, look at that. I love you unconditionally here. That's that King of Cups here, okay? That's that feeling I feel like you both have towards each other where you still love each other unconditionally here. And this is why this person wants to start over and start fresh with you. Yeah, look at that. I am grateful for the spiritual lesson here. This person is grateful for the spiritual lesson here, okay? They want to definitely give this another shot. They feel like they've learned spiritually, mentally, and emotionally what this connection or this relationship meant to them that you two share together. And they want to try to make things right here. You do have your free will, Leos. I mean, they've already portrayed you several times here, okay? So this is something that you're really going to have to think about, ponder, or reflect on, okay? Wow, powerful reading here, Leos. Let's get you some word advice before we close out your spread here today. Gordon Angels and Sisters, what word advice here can Leos take away from this spread? 
Whoa. Thank you, Spirit. We have Ten of Air here, a.k.a. the Ten of Swords. This is the same energy from this card right here. So some of y'all Leos, this person could be an air sign here. Aquarius, again, a Leo. I'm so, ooh, well, some of y'all, this person could be a Leo here. All right. I want to say a Libra or a Gemini here. Okay. It says the end of a difficult situation, Leos. Embrace the change and accept things to get better now. Wow. Didn't I mention this throughout the whole time of the reading? That's why that death card is here, Leos, because this situation has changed. You've changed. This person's changed. And it's definitely going to get better from here, okay? This person has learned a spiritual lesson here. This was meant for you both to learn and take away a spiritual lesson from this connection or this relationship here, all right? It says recovering from an addiction. Yeah, I feel like this person may have had an addiction here that they were doing or a pattern and became to grow toxic instead of being something healthy for the relationship. And it caused this person to make bad decisions here. Okay. Rather, this is a person putting you in a third party situation with others, doing things behind your back, taking from you. Okay. It caused a lot for this person to, you know, really check in with themselves. Okay. I feel like this was a pattern that was done over for some of you all 10 years okay all right and now this cycle is finally getting put to an end this person has finally been away with these type of patterns or situations and ways of doing things here leos wow beautiful so this has completed your reading here for today leos i hope the reading has resonated for you all if so, again, definitely don't forget to like, subscribe, hit that notification bell. Again, I am available for personal readings. If you would love to book personal reading with me, all that information is down below in the description box, my loves. Thank you all so much, Leos, for your continuous love and support. Definitely click that join link down below and join the Soul Tribe. You do get discounts, all right, on personal readings. We also have our own private community where I do post daily content over there as well, Leos. I thank you all for your continuous love and support, and I'll definitely talk to you soon. Bye-bye.